do you feel strong overcoming a challenge? Yes. So in what way do you need to overcome your mental health or your physical ailment? Think about it. What is rejected through state-pushed medication? Physical health. The importance of physical health. What's a good example of this? They destroy your physical body through chemotherapy. This is hardly therapeutic and is most often deadly. So passive drug use will only breed the same slow decay of life and vitality from within you. Therefore, focus on what the state rejects as important, the physical body. It needs to run like a well-oiled venomous machine, and if it does not, then what else do you expect? Popular medicine and popular morality belong together and ought not to be evaluated so differently as they still are. Both are the most dangerous pseudosciences. Modern man is becoming an unconsciously self-abusing zoo animal, and the state has become the invisible cage and leash which guides us to our unfortunate events. The laws of nature call us forth to change, yet do you feel the spirit calling you forth? She yearns eternally like the crashing waves of the ocean. She has always been there within, yearning you forth into the light of awareness, showing you what you do not want to see. Nietzsche's construct of great health includes the ability to attain what he calls plastic powers, which is the power of will. This can similarly be seen on the level of neuroplasticity, but instead the power to drive one's will to the constant surmounting and resisting of influences towards illness and other physical handicaps. Thus great health, Nietzsche writes, is quote, a health one not only has but constantly acquires and must acquire, because one again and again relinquishes it, must relinquish it. Individual health is all that exists fundamentally. The herd morality that forwards the motion of modern pharmac medicine as the antidote to complete health and wellness is a well orchestrated lie. To put your success at a disadvantage where the body's vitality is fundamentally rejected. The mental zeitgeist of today creates a one sided order which rejects the understanding of what it means to be human, which is a fully integrated mind and body spirit. Now, if you are an individual who is struggling with procrastination, wants to break bad habits for good, and is seeking mentorship to become the strongest version of themselves, then make sure to book a free consultation call down below with me, where we can have a chat and see how we can work with each other to create the most effective action plan possible. With that said, I hope you have a lovely day and I'll speak to you in the next video.